Hello everyone, we're here at KubeCon in Barcelona. With me is Aparna Sena. She is Director of Product Management of Kubernetes and... Anthos. Anthos, that's right. Can you uh, start off telling us what Anthos is? Sure. Anthos is our hybrid cloud offering that's based on Kubernetes Istio and our multi-cluster management control plane that's hosted in the cloud. We're here at KubeCon. This conference is all about open source. How does GKE relate to open source and why is there such a big presence uh, of Google here? Why the Google presence? Google is the originator of the Kubernetes project. It came from our history with Borg, as you know. You know, we've been running containers in production for 15 years now, and we're launching billions of containers, new containers, every week, even today. Um, so that's why Google is here. We're very, very passionate about this project. We have hundreds of engineers and product managers that are working on the project and have been since the last five years. As you know, it's the fifth anniversary of Kubernetes. And so we're having a birthday celebration here. Um, it's also the fifth anniversary, pretty soon this year, of GKE. So GKE was started pretty much in parallel with Kubernetes. It is our hosted version of Kubernetes running in Google Cloud, Google Kubernetes Engine. And um, it is you know, the oldest, most mature, most stable, and widely used um, distribution and, and hosted offering of Kubernetes in use today. So we're very, very excited about both Kubernetes as well as GKE, and they actually have really built off of each other. So another component of uh, Anthos that I'm really interested in is Istio. Can you tell me more about that? Yeah. As you move to microservices, um, you, you find that you actually have a lot of services in your environment, and you need a good way to manage those services. And, and in particular, you want to be able to uh, you know, monitor the services, have observability about which services are talking to which other services, to be able to set policies on those services from a security perspective, and to be able to um, control traffic when you need to. And this is the essential function of, a, of an SRE inside Google. Google, you know, a site reliability engineer. Um, you know, developers um, are not typically the ones that are making sure that the service is, um, you know, up and running or setting the security policies. And with Istio um, and with Anthos in general, what we do is we allow the ability um, for that separation of concerns, where you can have an SRE or operator type role that is doing the service management, that is taking care of monitoring, securing, and um, uh, ensuring the reliability of your services through that traffic management. Um, so that's the capability that we provide with Istio and then the combination of that and, Isti and, and Anthos configuration management which lets you from a single source of truth set policies both configuration policies, security policies, RBAC, mm -hmm. quota, these types of policies um, across your multi-cluster environment it allows you to do that from a single pane of glass. That's really um, what enterprises need, particularly as they have these multiple environments, whether they're you know different retail locations or on-prem, uh, different data centers and cloud, um, the configuration management capability and the service management capability is how they're able to standardize and manage uh, and have that, that operations team that can take care of the environment, freeing up the developers to do their coding and take care of the, the, the business functions that, that their business requires. So it sounds like the Anthos ecosystem is going to provide a lot of very awesome functionality to customers very soon. Um, so last question is, what are you looking forward to at KubeCon this, uh, this week? Well, I'm looking forward to your keynote. <laughs> That's definitely a, a, a big highlight. Um, I'm looking forward to meeting a lot of the ecosystem and the community here. Um, you know, an, another um, part of Anthos is our marketplace. So we've got a marketplace um, in Google Cloud, and what we've done actually um, in our workloads team is, um, you know, we've got the application object, mm. and we are working with a lot of the community here, a lot of the ecosystem, to create containerized forms of their applications, whether it's in the form of operators mm -hmm. or it's just you know containers or some other package that they that they that they want to use and then publishing it to the marketplace mm -hmm. in, in GCP and that marketplace is then available to all Anthos customers um, whether it's on GKE or it's on GKE on-prem and they can deploy those applications um, out, out you know just um, out of the out of the gate with support from the from the ecosystem so we're really bringing the open source ecosystem to Google Cloud users and I think um, that has a multiplicative effect um, and is a is a big reason to be here um, it's a big reason to um, you know to um, really build on um, 
build on what we've done with the community. That sounds awesome. Thank you so much for your time, Aparna.